Um, yeah, right, congratulations on the win. Um, yeah, I didn't see it, unfortunately, because I was at the interview. Um, yeah, talk me through it. It was a stoppage, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, stopped him in the um, second round. So the first round was, was kind of like, um, it was kind of kind of close. I was just feeling like the jab, yeah. um, working him out, seeing what he's got. Um, I think in the first round as well, I think I caught him with a, the same kind of shot and he stumbled a bit, so I knew that I could catch him with it. So yeah. then in the second round, my corner said to me, relax, relax. So I relaxed and I was just like waiting, moving my shoulders and then I threw a, like, a close shot, a close right hand that caught him and then that was it. It was a shot we've been working on in the gym this oh, week yeah. as well. So it's the last couple of like, like fights that you've had basically of like people like, been holding you and all sorts. It's not yeah. been, like the easiest like kind no, of fight. Yeah. So it's like you know good to kind of get yeah, your like, yeah. first professional it's good to get the stuff with, Yeah, because a lot of the time like they'll they'll hold so much that yeah. if you hit them with a shot they're just holding you for dear life. So yeah, it's good to get the win, the stoppage. Coach? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, obviously Ryan, Ryan's at his conversion stage now, you know, and um. In the gym, the difference with this fight was we actually started working on things like getting close. Mm -hmm. So it's pretty much his conversion from the amateurs to the professional. You will see a lot more of these things. You see he's punching a lot more shorter, he's getting inside, he's moving his shoulders. So, you know, early days, but good days. You know, um, it's a good win. It's a win we needed to have to grow. So from there onwards, you'll see very much that type of fighting. You know, he's punching more precise and you've got to gain the confidence. You know, when, when you look at boxing on a bigger scale, you've got to get these confidences. Confidence is coming good. So hopefully from there we take off. Getting, getting the knockouts, obviously, you know, yeah. uh, it's certainly going to build the contest. Um, what's, um, what's the plan like uh, when you hopefully get the next one? So, hopefully, I can get out again in the next six to eight weeks. Yeah. Um, I want to be active this year. Like, yeah. I want to try and have as many fights as possible this Are year. Are you going to move back down to Cruiserweight? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, I'm, this, I'm looking to try and get down to Cruiserweight for the next one and then just move, push on from there um, and start challenging for titles towards the end of the year. So, yeah, yeah man, that's the plan. Awesome. Awesome. Um, all right, but listen, before we go, do you want to shout out social media, anyone you want to thank? Or yeah, um, so the social media to start with, um, Instagram at Runnemover, also Twitter at Runnemover, uh, Facebook, Ryan Runnemover Charles. Um, I just want to big up my sponsors, Brown Eagle. Um, without them, like I couldn't do what I'm doing, so big them up, they can help me so much. Um, big up Body Works Gym, Ankara. Um, yeah, so everyone, all the fans as well, everyone supporting me. I'm starting from the bottom up, so, you know, I'm just working my way up, working hard, just trying to do what I do. So, thank you. Well, listen, everyone. thanks so much for both of you giving us a bit of your time, and, uh, yeah, we'll have to look forward to seeing you soon. And, yeah. Uh, yeah, good luck. Okay, thank you. Cheers. Cheers.